Hello, everybody. It is about five minutes to 5 a.m. in the uh, Chicago area. <laughs> yeah, Central Standard Time. Up or super early today. I've got a lot of stuff to do, so hopefully I will be back home in time to watch Don's live stream at 2 p.m., which is uh, 8 o'clock uh, Euro time, 7 o'clock UK time. Uh, now, let's see. It, yeah, it's June 4th, 2024. Uh, remember, hey, I'm a clairvoyant, clairaudience, so everything is entertainment purposes only. Um, disclaimers in the box, along with the email, if you want to schedule a private reading, the uh, buy me a coffee. And we do have the super sticker monetary stuff on the bottom because of the nonsense with some idiots. So, uh, yeah, we had to take down the, the PayPal. So it's now super stickers, super chats. And everything that comes in through that will go towards setting up the RSD Foundation and helping people with who live with RSD, CRPS. Uh, let's see what's been going on. Yeah, we saw the results from the election that Claudia something or other uh, won. And let's see how she handles the border crisis because uh, she's saying she's not going to do anything until she finds out if it's going to be Donald or a donkey. Hopefully, we've all been seeing what's going on, and uh, it's crazy because a lot of it, a lot of people's minds are going to change because yesterday, Monday, it was the jury selection for the Hunter Biden trial. Yeah, federal court because, like somebody else who should be, who's going to remain nameless right now, has admitted to being. Uh, liking the white nose candy and some other stuff that's like a rock that's smokable. And he's admitted that he's been doing all this illegal, putting in all these illegal substances in his body at the same time purchasing Pow Pow. So this is, I mean, anyone who's gone to go purchase a Pow Pow here in the States, you have to fill out this big form and what you put on there is like you're not under anything you're not supposed to be. You're not under the influence of anything that's illegal. Well, Hunter's lied, so now he's they tried last year to slide in this little thing, plea deal, but that blew up in his face, so now he's on trial. And hopefully he'll get the same treatment actually more extreme treatment than Donald. He better be, or else everyone's really going to be flying off the handle. So um, today's the opening statements, and of course, JoJo couldn't attend his son's trial, but his but Jill did, and that's how Jill spent her 73rd birthday. And of course, Ashley, the victim of her father, was there too, so... Um, let's see how things go in Wilmington over the next few days. Now, uh, the, with elections all over the place right now, India is going through their elections and that's going to be a complete cluster F, cluster bomb. And because there's so many people and it's like, I tried reading it and I'm like, oh, tch. Let's just wait to see what happens. But going on over there, you've got the Hindus, you've the Buddhists, you've got people who are worship a lot of different other gods. But the one thing that they're having fits about and what they don't like are the Muslims in India. That's why the partition took place way back when. So hopefully none of the poll starts will be elected in India because India, hey, they sent over 6,000 construction workers to Tel Aviv. Yeah, construction workers is a new term for 
yeah, we know what that means. Um, the other stuff, yes, Fauci is now admitting to lying about everything that was happening in 2020 and 2021. Now, I was, I was told on January 1st of 2020, don't believe a word the little WAP says. When I heard that from somebody reputable, that's how I lived my life. Never got the jabber do, never wore a face diaper, told people to go stick it. Hey, I had the Hong Kong flu. Back in 68, 69, that was a worldwide pandemic and no, nobody shut down. Yeah. So people who had uh, the Hong Kong flu, that's from what I was told. Um, that was the root virus that they did this 19C from. So I'm walking around with immunity from the base root. So why should I get a... I mean, I, I was at my doctor's yesterday. She goes, do you want the pneumonia shot? I go, hell no. I'm not getting any vaccine that I don't know anything what's in it. I'm like, no way on earth. I'm not getting anything put into my body that I don't need to have. Oh, so, yeah. So this week we do have to remember that it's 80 years ago. Um, D-Day happened. And we need to educate these young kids what happened in Europe starting in 38, 39. Because we can't allow that to happen. I mean, the regime of Adolf is being replicated by the uh, Islamic Republic of Iran. They're trying to shove their crap down our throats. No. No, it's not going to happen. Not at all. So if you have any WW2 vets around, make sure you give them a big hug and say thank you. Because without them, we wouldn't be having the life we have now. Oh, no. I did mention yesterday, yeah, was Jill Biden's 73rd birthday. Well, it's kind of ironic that allegedly today is the third birthday of a child that no one seems to have seen. Yeah, the uh, alleged daughter of Henry and Rachel. Now, is there going to be a birthday party? Did they rent out the Montecito house for... Uh, Another photo, photo op is, uh, has, uh, the Getty family found a pair of kids to put under contract for per perpetual photos. This, it, I, I, I have a feeling that this is going to be the start of the undoing of those two because that little boy is, what, five now? He has to start kindergarten or pre-K. Um, school district, someone can go do a Freedom of Information Act to see where what school this kid is allegedly uh, enrolled in. Yeah, pre-K here in the States. And as for the other stuff happening... Um, don't expect Catherine to be in the procession for Trooping of the Color. But she'll probably be quietly brought to the palace, to Buck House. And she will come out on the balcony for a few minutes to wave with the kids. And, uh, then go back and I probably <laughs> we may see the kids riding with Sophie and or Camilla um, 
So um, yeah, Andrew will be tucked in the background. Sarah, you will will probably be able to see through a window a glimpse of her red hair. But um, Catherine, I, I get the feeling she's not going to be in the big procession in the carriages, but she will come out on the balcony for the flyover. Okay. <clears throat> yes, allergies are super bad. So that's what I'm getting. <coughs> oh, oh. Sorry. And uh, I just wanted to get this up short because, um, yeah, I've got a, another doctor's appointment. I have to leave the house at 6, 645 for then some other stuff and then get back in time. So I want to make sure this is up and <clears throat> so everyone can see. Yeah, I did put a video up. It's not alive today. So, um, Fauci is going to end up getting charged for uh, crimes and basically for all the for lying. He's going to end up going down the tubes. Fauci will um, the Hunter Biden stuff is going to be really nasty, and now people are going to come out and um, Paula Jones, Monica Lewinsky, and every other person that was kind of bullied by Billy C. when he was at the Oval Office, all those women are going to start coming out and talking, and people are going to start squawking about. Okay, you put Donald up. We got to get Billy C. up there. And all the guys that uh, Barack harassed, they're all going to come out and start talking. It's start watching your scandal rags here in the States, like the National Enquirer, because those guys triple check everything now, ever since that lawsuit by Carol Burnett. Start watching the scandal rags. They're going to start telling the real story. And when I go out today, I'll see if I can grab at least one or two of them. Um, so everyone have a good day. Yeah, it's Tuesday the 4th. I'll um, be talking to you on the 6th. Bye.